Community Now. Today is National HIV and AIDS Awareness Day in the Kandara Center. Well, they're hosting an event to mark this occasion. Joining us now is Jesus Rosa to tell us more about the event. Thank you so much Thank you for, for joining me. us today. Tell us exactly what's happening on October 15th. Well, what we're doing is we're partnering up with the mayor of the city of Springfield, Mayor Sarno, and what we're doing is we're going to be raising a flag, um, National Latino HIV and AIDS Awareness flag, just to spread awareness in the Latino community. Uh, we're going to be at the footsteps of City Hall. We will be making history again in the city of Springfield in the state of Massachusetts for raising the flag at City Hall. And we're just going to have a small ceremony, um, and we're basically going to be discussing the importance of why people should get tested and or linkage to care. And no. you can see it's actually this yeah. Friday, too, just to fix. I said the 15th, but it's the 18th. Actually, yes, it's Friday the 18th, yes. and it's at noontime at the footsteps of City Hall. Awesome. And it's also vigil as well as flag raising there, so I'm guessing it's going to be emotional as well because yes. there are stories associated with each person who has. Yes, this. most definitely. I myself, at the age of 10, I lost my grandfather due to complications in HIV and AIDS, and at that time I wanted to do something to help him. Here we are today, and we're doing that exactly. So it's very important to spread awareness. We're also, um, I'm a poet, so we're also gonna have a poetry in motion. We have our lyrical dancers coming by as well, just to kind of have the emotional feel of why it's important. Are you are you looking for speakers still? Or um, anybody to join in I, on that, or is I, that planned I, out? Yeah, everything is all said, I appreciate it though. But people can't come out then and still yes, support this. definitely, it's important for the community to come out, because the more people that come out, the more voices that are spreading awareness, yes. And more voices are spreading awareness to HIV and AIDS. So tell us how important it is to really come out and, and tell your story to inspire somebody else who might be suffering from the same thing. I think uh, we still live in a world where people live with stigma and when people think of HIV they think of stigma so I think it's important to be front and center be the voice for those that can't be the voice for themselves that are battling through this condition because it's important to know that there is linkage to care out there as well as the support that is needed. What specifically with the Latino community is uh, driving such an event here today because this one does seem focused. Yes. Are they more uh, at risk? More, yeah, more definitely at risk. Um, uh, I grew up in a Latino household where my family didn't talk about uh, protection or sexual health, and that creates um, us, our adolescents at youths, you know, to practice higher risk behaviors. So it's very, very important in a Latino community as well as our people of color community to spread awareness, but most importantly, education. And all are welcome at this event, all yes. ages. You encourage everyone to come out. And what's the goal? for you this Friday? The goal for me this Friday is just to be able to spread awareness in our community, not only in the Latino community, but in the community of, of Springfield, Massachusetts. Um, as you guys may know, the rates are going higher. You know, people are practicing um, high-risk behaviors, and I think it's so important to go out in the community and educate those that don't have the education that is needed. Absolutely. Well, thank you so much for joining us today. Thank you for Remind having me. Remind everyone if they want more information on the event, where they can go. Uh, if you guys want more information, you can visit us at the Gandara website. Uh, we are on Facebook, and we also have an Instagram, uh, or you can go at thegandaracenter.org. And it's going to be tomorrow, uh, Friday, at noontime at the footsteps of City Hall with the mayor. Making awesome. history. Yes, we are. Be pretty One cool. city at a time. That's what we're trying to do here. Absolutely. Awesome. Thank, you thank you for having me. I appreciate thank you so it. Much. I give you why. I'm still learning. He's got a broken hand. I appreciate that. <laughs> thank you guys for having me. No